terrifying. What's up guys? Today we're at Arches National Park in Utah and here's our first location. What is this arch? Landscape arch. This is Landscape Arch. We have about a 8.9 mile hike around the whole park. See all the arches and stuff. So stay tuned. Here we are at the double O arch at Archers National Park. Pretty cool so far. Uh, it's about like 7, what, 7.50? It's gonna get dark soon, so we're gonna try and hike around the park. And once it gets dark, hopefully we'll see some rattlesnakes or something and get an up close shot. <laughs> I gotta find it again. Yeah. Oh my gosh. They don't usually tend to do that. That's the thing. He's in that bush somewhere. Yeah. Careful. I guess it's a bear spot. That was terrifying. Uh, very camouflage. Squeeze the I'm trying to keep my like, the most right. Here's a great basin rattlesnake we came across while hiking out of Archers National Park. These snakes are subspecies of the western diamondback and are commonly confused with the great basin gopher snake. For someone that has seen both these snakes, I will say their appearance is very similar except for one is highly venomous while the other is not. The great basin rattlesnake grows up to 16 to 64 inches, so upwards of 5 feet. They mainly prey on mammals such as prairie dogs, chipmunks, as well as lizards, birds, and other snakes. 
It was very cool to be able to get an up-close look at the snake and hear the rattle. I would advise to keep a safe distance if you come across any venomous snake, even though rattlesnakes aren't known to bite unless provoked. I hope you all enjoyed the video and we will see you on the next animal encounter.